Are you looking back at your year and finding yourself amazed at all you've made it through? Does the beginning of this year feel like forever ago and a second ago all at once? For us too. We were busy moving into the expanded office area in Jerusalem when the Russian-Ukraine war broke out. Half a dozen of our team immigrated from both Russia and Ukraine years ago and had both friends and family in the war zone. And so helping people trying to flee the situation or forced to stay became front and center of the activities of I Stand With Israel. We even sent a team to the border of Hungary and Ukraine to help with guiding refugees to safety. Many of the refugees fleeing Ukraine were Jews, and so when they arrived in Israel, I Stand With Israel, our benevolence fund, was there to help with various practical and medical needs. Spring was upon us before we knew it, and the Maoz Israel tour set off across the ancient and modern paths of our nation. Together, we commemorated sobering days like Holocaust and Memorial Day, and then closed the trip out with street celebrations on Israel's Independence Day. We barely took a breath before it was time to fly two dozen Israelis to the US for the Maos Israel Worship Tour and the Maos Generations Conference. It was the beginning of our fulfilling the call to send the word of the Lord forth from Zion to the nations. The summer also included the Ba'o sponsored leadership and sports camp for children, in which every child was trained in a variety of sports, mentored in the ways of godly leadership, and given two kids' devotionals we just finished translating in Hebrew. Several congregations have even begun using these devotionals as a guide for their Shabbat's kids' classes. Fall welcomed us with fresh deadlines for the all-new Ma'oz Israel TV show that began airing on Daystar Espanol in November. We also begin offering the Ma'oz Israel Report in audio format, as well as the all-new Israeli Insiders podcast that covers all things Israel. We already have so much more in store for next year. January is at the door, and we already don't know how we're going to get everything done we have planned. But we said that at the beginning of this year, too. And our partners gave of themselves and held our hand from day to day. And here we are saying, wow, look what the Lord has done. So how about it? Want to be a part of the Maos Israel story of 2023?